hello and welcome back to Feathers of Wisdom. I'm Stacy, the Black Feather Intuitive. Today I thought we would talk about how to embrace the magic in each moment. A while back I released a video on embracing your now, being in the now, being present in that moment. This is a little bit different. This is about finding the magic in every moment. Um, obviously we have many moments in our lives that could be described as magical. But we have just as many moments that can often cause confusion, be confusing, uh, be frustrating. You can be angry in it and, and just really not understand where the magic is in that moment. And I thought today we would do a card poll to see what the universe has to say on how we can take lemons and make lemonade um, and find the magic in each moment so that instead of having a negative experience, we can turn it into a positive experience, learn from it and move forward into that magic. So let me grab the trusty Osho Zen deck. And let's see what she has to say today. Ooh, that one popped out at me. Oh, I like this one, rebirth. Okay, so embracing the magic in each and every moment. I love that we pulled the rebirth card. How perfect. Every moment can be remade. You can be reborn in every single moment. If you make a decision that you don't like and the, the outcome is not what you're looking for, you can turn around in any given moment and make a different decision, make a different choice and change the outcome for the better. Make it into something that you really are looking forward to. In every single moment, there is that magical opportunity to turn it into whatever it is that you want it to be. What a great card for this. So let's take a, a deeper look into the card itself. So we have this sort of gray camel figure with two humps sort of in the sky. There's, you know, gray cloudy skies. And then you've got a lion. And then what is this guy here? He's a flautist. He's playing the flute, playing some music, and he is rising above, and he is coming out of the lion. So he's actually being reborn from the lion, coming from this lower place, a gray, uh, gray area, gray place, sadness, ick, neutrality. And he's being reborn through this lion, a very, very powerful beast, powerful animal. Um, when, when humans come in line with the lions, oftentimes we're a little bit scared and nervous because the lion is, you know, going to sort of bite our heads off and have us for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. So we need to be smart when we do that. Well, what this is symbolizing is we have that inner strength and that inner power of the lion, of the beast within us, and we can choose to harness that and come out and change it. Um, into a different power, channel it into something different. And in his case, he's making music. And he's sort of coming into the sun, coming into the light, coming into the truth of the matter, and having a lot more fun than what he would be having uh, here in this sort of gray neutrality. So I would say the Rebirth card is a great card. What an awesome reading to talk about finding the magic in each moment taking a moment even when you're in the gray and the neutral and making a, a tweak to your decision to your truth looking at it a different way and saying yeah this kind of sucks how can i make this better how can i put a little pizzazz into it put a little color into it how can i uh transform this and and be reborn out of this experience into something stronger into a better version of me in each and every moment I hope this was helpful. I hope you all enjoy your weekend. Till next time, take care.